well, we could go with this one, or we could go with that one. And this one here, this is, whoa, oh, hey, hi, you caught me. I was just studying the length of my nose and looking at what it would be like if it were longer. Yeah. Do you like your nose? Do you like the, the size of your nose? Do you ever wish it was longer or shorter? Well, do you remember the story of Pinocchio? Pinocchio was that wooden puppet who dreamed of becoming a real boy. The only issue Pinocchio had, though, was whenever he lied, what happened? Yep, his nose grew. It started out shorter, but then it got longer, and then it got longer the more lies he told. So he had a nose, like, really long. Now, I don't think I ever saw my nose get longer. I never saw it this long. And I don't think I ever saw any of your noses get longer. So what would you think if your noses or if our noses got longer whenever we told a lie or even did something we shouldn't have? So this sort of reminds me right now of a snowman because of carrot nose. But anyhow, I'm thinking about Pinocchio and Pinocchio telling the truth and telling lies and his nose getting longer. Well, speaking of truth, today we're going to talk about this title of Jesus. Jesus is the truth. Now, Jesus never told a lie, so his nose did not get longer like Pinocchio's. In fact, Jesus said, I am the way and the truth and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. That's found in John 14, 6. And in these next few videos, we're going to be talking about that verse a little more. I am the way and the truth and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. So, what did Jesus say about the truth? Well, he didn't say that he would show the truth. He didn't say he would teach the truth or that he would just model the truth. He said he is the truth. Now, you know, the character of God is holiness. It's righteousness. It's truth. God is totally, totally perfect. There's nothing wrong with God. He can do no wrong. He is no wrong. He can't speak any untruths. He is truth. So the character of God is truth. He is trustworthy. That means that we can believe in him. We can count on him. We can know that everything that comes from God is truth and it is good and it is pure and it is holy. Wow. The Apostle John in his books and letters, the Gospel of John and 1st and 2nd and 3rd John, those are all found in the New Testament. In his writings, he made a point to remind us that Jesus is God, that Jesus is divine. John 1.14 says, And the Word became flesh and dwelt among us, and we have seen his glory, glory as of the only Son from the Father, full of grace and truth. Jesus was truth. The Holy Spirit is also truth. And the Holy Spirit is who Jesus left with us. God has given us this gift of a part of his being, the Holy Spirit coming and speaking truth to us. And Jesus promised in John 16, when the Spirit of truth comes, he will guide you into all the truth. You know that when Jesus prayed for his disciples and for us in John 17, he said this. He said, Lord God, sanctify them, sanctify these people in truth. Your word is truth. Bathe them in truth. Surround them with truth. May they know your truth, God. This statement, I am the way, the truth, and the life, is crucial to our faith in Jesus. No one comes to the Father except through him. Very, very important. And Jesus desired truth for his followers, for us, that we walk in truth, that we show truth, that we exhibit truth in our lives. 1 John 3.18, children, let us not love in word or in talk, not just the things we say, but in deed and in truth. So our words and our deeds, the actions that we do, should all be truthful. Well, so Pinocchio, when he would lie or do an untruth, his nose would get longer. I hope that that is not true for any of us, that we are truth tellers. And we are truth doers, even as we follow Jesus, who is the truth. So, Jesus is the truth. Remember that. And today, if you happen to think about if you want your nose to be longer or shorter, 
Well, that's not really that important, is it? Your noses look fine. But if you decide to model with a carrot like this, then maybe you'll have a snack for later, right? <laughs> so you all have a really good day. I hope it's a day filled with joy and above all else, a day filled with peace. Hmm, this carrot looks pretty appetizing though, huh? Oh, I hit my nose. <laughs>